We found a boat, then sailed away from the island. We had to. We didn't belong there. The new guy's name was George. I noticed when the anarchist said his name, he said it with a thick Belkan accent. How did you know that he was from Belka? Well, both my parents were from Belka, so... You never told me that. They say that Belkans are known for their conspiracies. <laughs> That's just a stereotype. Now, I simply stated my honest opinion and was thrown in jail for it. The princess sat there looking miserable. That was a dumbass stunt she pulled back there, but it got us on this boat. Take a look at that. This ship is heading for a single rope that's hanging down from the sky. I'm sorry it's still standing there. Do you know how far the end of that rope reaches? Outer space. I think it would have been battered to no. shit. It is a direct connection to the very potential of mankind itself. Or at least it was until war erupted. It's my strong belief that the rope might be connected to a very distant, faraway source of, of great conflict and strife. Even long before the war, the whole world started falling apart once Harling began trying to build it. But why? I often wonder, what was going through Harling's mind when, when he was trying to destroy the very thing that so many people were sacrificed in order to create. Sacrificed? What do you mean? Have you seen all of those countless old space shuttles on Tyler Island that are no longer in use? Yeah. <laughs> I always thought of them as a good source of scrap. They're an obsolete technology that was abandoned during the construction of the space elevator. Which would mean that if the space elevator was destroyed, it would be that much harder for mankind to reach the stars. Until we find another way. But even then, Harling still went ahead and tried to destroy it. At the cost of his own life. Wait, when the hell... That's not the way I heard it. Copter went back towards the... What I heard was that he sacrificed himself to protect the tower from an incoming missile. Oh... I was told he tried to fly his ship into the tower in order to destroy it. I wonder which story is true, your royal highness. I don't know. Looking at it objectively, it's reasonable to believe that Harling had both options before him. When it comes to which one you think he took, I guess it's like a mirror. Yes, it is. It's like a mirror looking into your own soul, based on whichever choice you believe it was. At the moment, though, I can only see darkness. I think... I think that thing should be destroyed. What the fuck is up with you? Two, especially the princess lady. You know how much resource it takes to build that? It's time for the briefing. Although, since we don't have any contact with HQ, it's not like this is an official mission. Anyway, it looks like the seizure of Tyler Island and the relief from Osea have been postponed. In the meantime, we just have to do what we can to survive. Since losing its capital city of Ferbanti, Eurusian forces have separated into smaller, autonomous factions. It looks like Eurusia's largest force and leading faction will pass through the area around this base. The space elevator is significant to them, so they're probably heading there. Should we intercept? Why? I doubt they're gonna start a fight now. Our top priority should be to get home. Let's go already. Yeah. It's not like we have the supplies, power, or even a real reason to 
put up a fight. Oh, Trigger wants to have a fight. But Let's do it. What are we going to do if they bring the fight to us? We'll be with the rest of the army. Ready to push them back. If we head inland from here towards Arusha, there's an old castle that's been converted into a stockpiling base. Shalaji Castle. It's currently occupied by some of the Erosion forces How do we that have... broke off, but we need ammo and fuel. They appear to have converted a freeway into a runway, so we can expect them to have the capacity for air combat. But they'll be easier to handle than Arusha's lead faction. But we can't use all our aircraft to attack. The transport carrying the stolen supplies needs support. Okay, Strider Squadron. You head out first, and neuter the dogs at the stockpiling base. Rendezvous with Cyclops Squadron, who will bring the transport. Then we bring the supplies back to this base. Got it. Aircraft are our only threat. Sounds good. We'll but make this grand target. We're all gonna fly home. Together. Okay, so how do we have the espionage information intel to know what they're doing sorry I hit my mic what they're doing and all that stuff but we don't know what the fuck is happening to our own country there is things like radio and ham radio I think that the mil that at least the United States military and other major militaries are hey what happens if shit hits the fan oh right we use this technology I mean if all United States satellites went down Shit would be bad, but um, there's backups instead of being like, I don't know, what are gonna do? Strider squadron, so I think I didn't get the right parts on it. Also, why, like, okay, space stuff is in demand right now since all the satellites went down. Don't go destroying the thing that helps us try and get into space. Bitch. No forces are in the region ahead. No allies here. No need to ID your target. Oh, okay, cool. We've set a number of priority targets, focusing on their anti-aircraft. Oh good, it's a flat okay, land. To work. Unidentified aircraft, not sure of friend or foe. Fire anyway. We don't have time to be wondering if they're friendlies or not. So, we capture this base and take the fuel and supplies. That's the plan, right, Trey? Yeah. You take if you want to live. That's how it was where I grew up. I was just double checking mission orders, Hoosian. Hoosian? Oh, you're such a Hoosier. Well, that's a tank there. Are we committing war crimes? Don't give up! We're not going to lose our country again! There aren't that many. Aim carefully and take them down. Yeah, so what's this forward. faction split from the Erujian military? The autonomous state of Shalaji used to be a nation. The region has always leaned towards independence. Why are they Those who want to restore pay? their homelands... That yeah, guy's already... ...in that. Officers from Boston, Church, Are they our enemies? They're our enemies, enemy, but not our friends. Hurry up and take out the fire! They're bombing us! We're unable to use the SAMs! The resistance is strong. They seem pretty desperate. They seem pretty strong, but we're wrecking them pretty hard. What happened to that one guy? Oh, I guess we're gonna fight him. At some point, because country. Sorry, he's being really slow. Target 
I don't know, just fire more missiles! I'm wondering if there's like different endings since we could target the princess or if that was just a fail state thing. Like, what do my allied guys do? I saw him hit that aircraft and it seemed to do jack fucking shit. Those guys? This is the Ocean Long Range Strategic Strike Group. Land immediately and hand over your planes and base to us. I should have gone for that guy. What is going on there? Suck it.
That guy was flying way too straight for way too long to do that. The one mission I'm like, hmm, probably going to uh, use get the ground stuff. Really? Flying with him. High speed protected on launch from enemy aircraft. I'm testing this aircraft. You must find your own sky. We can still help you. Don't waste your life. Dedicated to reclaiming that which you call home. Furthermore, you must find someone to guide you. I am not that person. The guy that's flying real slow, like. Yeah, I want an aircraft that can take four hits from a gun. Why do you feel the need to continue fighting on your own? 
That's funny. It seems like one of your pilots is also fighting alone. He's not alone. Look around you. I see. Perhaps it would have been best to entrust the future to pilots like that. Let me test him then to see if he's truly worthy. Wow, that... I don't know how it, uh, seems to track so well. How is it hitting him? You should jump out of your airplane. This was all due to my ego. I unleashed pure chaos upon this world, just so I could keep my wings. Put a stop to the drone production. Is this a message to Trigger? What does it mean? <laughs> I don't think this war is over just because we shot down Mr. X. Yeah, it's gonna take something else entirely to end this thing. I just don't know what. What? Oh wait, one sec. Okay, I was like, wait, they don't do that in this game? Because I remember them doing it in previous games. The resupply went well. We should be okay on food and fuel reserves for a little while at least. Luckily, the rumor that the Erujian army is advancing nearby is only a rumor. There's no sign of them from the skies. Rumors, rumors, rumors. This is what happens when you lose communications. But we got one good fact. The plane trigger shot down was an advanced model of the X-02 Wyvern. It was developed in the last Continental War. Erugia had a lot up their sleeves. Apparently, they were even supposed to have Belkin aircraft back in the first war. What if Trigger couldn't shoot it down? Just thinking about it gives me chills. We're lucky to be here. Yeah, in war, you never know what's lurking behind the curtains. Yeah, besides but the advance. It looks like everything's loose now. A solid chain of command, rest periods after sorties, a battlefield where you know friend from foe. All of that's gone now, lost in a fog of confusion. Feels like a distant dream. Now, just how the hell are we gonna get out of this mess? Done with your junk and rant? Yeah, I guess... Uh, wow! How did... What god is that? Oh, first time completion bonus was a big up. That's what rank bonus is. Well, that's going to be the end of this Let's Play, so I'd like to thank you all for watching. Please comment, because like comments, tell me what you like, dislike, tips, or so otherwise. If you like my YouTube, like, see, grow, then please like, subscribe, and check out our videos that grow. And please remember to spam and your animals that control the pit population. And until next time, let's say, me, Game of Wolves, 6 of Ace Combat 7. See ya.